evidence that I'm a Christian, I hate sin. You have to ask yourself that. Do you hate sin? Here's what Psalm 97 verse 10 says. You who love the Lord hate evil. It's, it's not a, a statement of fact that you who love the Lord hate evil. It's a command. You guys who say you love the Lord, you should hate evil. You should hate it. When you see a teacher who's teaching children that they can be non-binary with their genders and telling adults if you don't submit to that child's thought process, then you need to be corrected as an adult. And that teacher is teaching kids in our community, you should hate that sin. Don't hate the person, but you should hate that evil that is here in our society. When people say, well, you know, that's their thing. You know, I'm, who am I to say what's right or wrong? What do you mean? You're a representative of God. That's who you are. That's why you're still here, to give testimony to what truth is. And we have the word of truth right here. He's given it to you so that you might live by it and declare it to a dark and dying world. Who are we to say anything? We're ambassadors of the Lord. We have his Holy Spirit in us to declare truth. We should hate sin. Now that's a problem for us. Why? Because we sin. There is a part of us called flesh that is at battle with our spirit, which means if we love God, there's a part of ourselves that we hate. And that goes against what the world teaches us. They teach us, you are perfect just the way you are. You need to love yourself. Blah, 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 just sick. There is a part of us that we should view in disdain because there's a part of us that breaks the heart of a living God. If we say we love God, but we're okay with sin, we are liars. That simple. So test number one, is there evidence that I, I'm a Christian? Yeah, I hate sin. 